Hello there, my name is Fernando and I'm a developer advocate here at GitLab and today I'm going to go over one of the newly released security features in GitLab 17.5. Today I'll be covering dependency list filtering which allows you to apply filters to your dependency list also known as SBOM or Software Bill of Materials to quicker identify your dependencies by criteria. Now let's get started. In order to access the dependency list, go to the side tab and hover over secure and then click on dependency list. Here you'll see an SBOM or software build materials containing all the dependencies within your group or project. In this case, we are using our group. From here, we can see the component, packager, location, license, and project of the dependency. If we click on a dependency that contains a vulnerability, we can see the vulnerability and access its vulnerability page if we click on the vulnerability description. Now let's get into the searching. From the search bar, we can search by license. I'm going to select the MIT license so I can see all projects within my group that contain that license. I can also sort by project and component. Then I'll go ahead and click the search icon and now I can see all the projects in my group containing the MIT license. I can also navigate to those projects by clicking on project or I can directly navigate to the location of the dependency file. By using dependency list filtering, you can now save time in understanding what packages and versions are present within your application as you no longer have to manually go through the entire list of dependencies. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed. To learn more about dependency list filtering and other GitLab security and compliance features, see the links in the description. And make sure to click that subscribe button 